going on guys, Fly NBC here, and we're back for another Pokemon Masters video. Now, we are on the official Japanese account for Pokemon Masters, and they revealed a good amount of stuff, and I'm actually very excited for this, and they revealed the stamina system. Uh, now, I don't speak uh, Japanese. I mean, I, I, I have been learning a little bit of it, but that's irrelevant because, well, I won't be able to translate this myself, so <laughs> we're going to need the help of uh, Google Translate. Now, I know Google Translate isn't always the best, but at least we're going to be able to get some kind of idea uh, of uh, what they're talking about. So, I do follow the Japanese Twitter account, so this is what they're posting. So this is basically the account level up. So like obviously when the stamina comes in, you're going to be leveling up based on how much stamina you use, which is typical for these kind of gacha games or just in games in general that use stamina. Uh, so like, I mean, the icon for the leveling up, I, I really like that. I really, really like that. It's, uh, it's not set in stone because uh, we're still waiting for about a week until this comes out so they could finalize it and uh, maybe change it up a little bit too so this this is not like the like 100 percent final version maybe unless it is but as you could also see uh, in the picture you can see on the top corner over here that uh that's how everything will look like player rank and uh clearly <laughs> pr player rank so that would be pretty cool um now it also says level 40 over there, but I'm not sure what it says, but let's translate the tweet and see what they have to say. Uh, test introduction of stamina function. Stamina will now be consumed when, play when playing some battles. Consumed stamina recovers once every six minutes. So that's actually not bad. That's actually not bad. Because a lot of the stamina games, like you could recover one stamina every 15 minutes, which is stupid. Uh, so having it for six minutes for one, one stamina is actually not bad. That's not bad at all. Uh, the upper limit of stamina increases as you rank up. So we already know about that. And then please check the background below for the introduction of the test. So, uh, all right. So that's it for the first tweet. And they have many, uh, multiple tweets about the stamina. Uh, so we're going to go down, uh, and then this is here. Uh, so now we're going to go to this tweet here. Uh, it's tickets. I don't know what this is, so let's just translate this. Uh, add skip ticket. Okay, so it's the skip ticket. Uh, so like, if you if you don't want to battle, like you are short on time or something, and you have uh, the skip tickets that you want to go for, you can use that and uh, skip your battles for a certain amount of stamina, and will do it automatically, and you get your rewards. So most games, most gacha games have this anyways. Uh, the only game that I know of that doesn't really have this is Dokkan Battle, but they do have like some kind of system like where it will make it faster to get through the battles, but there are uh, skip tickets, so I'm actually, like it, it was uh, obvious that they were gonna add something like this anyways, because we already have a, uh, well, we don't have a skip ticket, but we have a replay ticket, so it would make sense if they add in a skip ticket also. Uh, but let's see what they say here. Add skip ticket. In some battles, you will be able to use skip tickets if you meet the usage uh, conditions. So, like, obviously, if uh, the stage costs, uh, let's just say, for example, 10 stamina, and you don't have 10 stamina uh, because your player rank isn't high enough, you won't be able to do the stage. So, you're going to have to level up in order to uh, play that stage, alone, uh, uh, let alone with uh, uh, using the skip ticket. So, that's that. But, like, it looks pretty cool. I like it. Um, pretty straightforward, actually. I can't get away from the fact that, like, the player account and, uh, uh, stamina is gonna be at the top. That's gonna be getting used to, but I like it. It's a cool change that I'm liking a lot. Uh, now we come down here, which is actually one of the biggest things as well. Uh, the, the revamp of the training area. So, uh, this is how it's gonna look like. So you have everything organized. So you have the leveling up uh, uh, manual is still in its own little category. And then you have the level cap stuff all in one uh, category. So like if you want to level cap your uh, strikers or uh, supports, whatever, it's all going to be in one stage. So you can get all of them in one area. And then you have your co-op orbs that you can do as well. And then you have uh, your evolution material. So everything is all 
in its own category, which is pretty cool. I like that better because it's not like a full list, like a gigantic list of, uh, oh my god, there's so much uh, events that I need to do. That's, no. <laughs> I like this a lot better. And, uh, like, it, it, it looks good. The stamina system, everything that they're showing so far looks very good. Um, and it looks clean. As in, like, it doesn't look like a disaster. So they definitely know what they're doing when it comes to, uh, well, obviously they're <laughs> they're a good company. So I, I I wouldn't hold them I wouldn't hold anything against them that they won't know what they're doing. Uh, but it does look very good. I like what they're doing there. But let's see what they have to say in this tweet. Uh, so add training area in the training area. You can get dogs for what? <laughs> what? In the training area, you can get dogs for neutering buddies. What is going on? I I think that's just the Google Translate uh, mis uh, mistranslation. <laughs> uh, okay, but anyways, buddy drop area. Uh, that's probably not what it is either. But evolution evolved stone area. I don't know if that's what's gonna be called too. Have a daily limit. So yeah, that's. It's basically like a super course as well, so that's, um, so, uh, yeah, <laughs> we're gonna get, like, the super course is basically, like, all buffed up, like, we're gonna get better rewards, basically, uh, like, I would hope so, uh, but it also says, with this addition, training and major training will be ab abolished, uh, abol- okay, uh, I don't know if that's exactly what they meant, but <laughs> that's okay. But the new trading area does look a lot better. Uh, so, I don't know. But we'll have to see. It's going to come out in like a week. So, we'll just have to see how how it is when it comes officially. But this is what the official Pokemon, Twitter, uh, Pokemon Twitter says. The Japanese Twitter is uh, posted. So, we're just going off of that. And I think that's about it for what they have to post about uh, the new system. Uh, but let's take a quick rundown to see if there's anything else. No, that's about it. So, all right. So when, when the system comes out, I'm really looking forward to the stamina system. It's going to be pretty straightforward. Uh, the higher rank you are, the more stamina you're going to have. So then the more time you're going to be able to play and get better rewards. Uh, but obviously everybody, when we update is going to be level one. So like starting like from... I think maybe the 28th or the 29th, like whenever the battle villa is done, that's when the update is most likely going to happen. So probably by the 28th or the 29th, when the update comes, everybody's going to be level one and we're going to have the stamina. Now, this is not going to be set in stone. Like if nobody likes it, they're going to take out the system and go back to the old system and then adjust from there. Uh, cause they already said like in the dev letter that if, uh, they get a lot of feedback and not a lot of people like it, they'll go back to the old system. So they're not going to completely abandon the system that they had starting out Pokemon Masters up until this day. Uh, so don't worry about that. If you don't like the stamina system, have hope that it will come back the old system. <laughs> uh, but from how it looks like. I think it will be a success and everybody, well, a lot of people like it. Obviously, they're not going to make everybody happy, uh, but it does look cool and it does look good. So I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I'm very excited about the player, like account level up profile, uh, the play rate. That, that's what I'm really excited for. Now, the thing I have about this is like if nobody likes the stamina system and they go back to the old system, the one thing I'd like to see stay is the player profile like the player rank that's what i'd like to see because it would be super easy for them to implement that into the game even with the old system uh because every time we do a battle we get a certain amount of xp for our profile and uh, what that could do is like uh, if we get to a certain buff because it's not like we do player versus player or anything so like if nobody likes the stamina system and we go back to the old system Maybe like the the profile the profile rank could stick and uh, when we get to a certain level we get buffs for certain teams and stuff like that I think that would be pretty cool. Like for example, let's say we get to level 50 we get a buff for uh, uh, for like 
fire types or e electric types or something like that that would give uh 20 percent defense or something i don't know like i just want to see the profile rank stick even if uh, the stamina system goes away because nobody likes it but we'll have to see we'll have to see but for now let's just see how the stamina system is before we uh say anything uh, because we, we can't really judge the stamina system based off of these pictures. Like, we have to actually play with the system to see how it works. And to see if it's actually doable. So, that'll be it for the video. Just wanted to show this off because I woke up and I just saw uh, them tweeting this. So, I was like, cool. Because <laughs> six hours, I was obviously asleep. So, when I woke up, this is on my Twitter feed. And uh, other Pokemon Master YouTubers have been uh, posting this as well. So, I'm like, okay. Let me get into the little mix and uh, post my video on this too. So, <laughs> uh, but when I saw this, I was like, hell yeah, this is gonna be awesome. Uh, but I can't wait. I'm excited for this. I don't know about you guys, but let me know in the comments. Let me know if you're excited about this system coming to the game. Uh, because right now it does look promising and I'm pretty excited about it. But that'll be it for the video. And I will see you guys on the next one.